Now, the old water tower on the outskirts of this shithill town has been derelict for ages. It's amazing they haven't torn the damn thing down yet. I reach up for the next rung, which groans in response to the unexpected weight before snapping off entirely. I manage to catch myself at the last second, but my GoPro isn't so lucky. It makes a soft plop in the snow below. Well, there goes my perfect fucking selfie. It was a close call, though, so I take a second to catch my breath before I steal my nerves and continue my ascent. I can't turn back now. Stick to the plan. You're gonna be remembered for this. I clamber onto the platform, and I'm greeted with an oversized grin. A rival school's idiotic mascot. His face is weathered and peeling. Good thing it's about to get a brand new paint job. Now all I need to decide is exactly how many dicks I should add. Time to get to work. Let's see here. Just one more. Ooh, let's have this one splooging all over it. Pink. What did I think I was going to do with pink paint? Give them some missing teeth. Oh, they all look just like those inbred jack-offs. A little bit more and done. I stand back and admire my creation in all its glory. In just a few hours, people will wake up to their beloved avatar being assaulted by a group of floating penises, as if it were the star of a haunted bukkake. Now all I need to do is snap some pics for the guys to prove that, yes, I am that fucking badass. So I whip out my cell and I get to work lamenting the fact that I can't post these online. Hashtag Dicasso. It's a good time as any for a smoke, so I spark one, look out over the woods that surround the town. Last night's snowfall blanketed the landscape, leaving a pristine coat of white that went for miles and miles. And I could see the lake off in the distance from my vantage point. I could clearly see over the privacy fence that encircles it. As the early morning fog began to dissipate, I could even see on the water's surface, and what the fuck is that? I cut my hands around my eyes as if make-believe binoculars could somehow improve my vision and lean out over the railing. There was definitely something bobbing in the surface. It... Oh, fuck. It looks like there's someone out there. Well, I can't be right. It is. I closed that like off years ago. To keep it in. Something about an undertow. Oh, fuck. It's not my fault if some random nobody gets themselves killed. They're closer to you You know, as much as I want to turn away, I, I can't. Because you want to know the truth. I'm frozen to the spot, precariously hanging over the railing. There's, there's something about them. Something familiar? Don't you remember? The redhead. Katie We met in home ec. She was always so patient and caring. She's still took a trip with me and several of my classmates over the summer to check out the new Space Mountain. We shared our first kiss during the fireworks display on the third night. And I made some dumb promises I couldn't keep. They're still dumb. 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 Oh, a total blast to have around. Always wanted me to tag along on his misadventures. He didn't want to be alone. We got caught sneaking in to see Jaws, and I managed to get away before the cops showed up, but he wasn't so lucky, but he... Never sold me out. He always had my back. Don't let him down. Been more. Lived across the street from me our entire lives. He's been there the whole time. I could never ask for a better friend. And we began drifting apart when he started getting pretty deep into his schoolwork. He was scared when you were leaving. Every once in a while he'd stop by just to chill, but... Because he misses you. Don't you miss him too? Last time we talked, we went to a Queen concert at the Paramount back in April. I fall backwards, reeling from a mix of vertigo from the height, lightheadedness from the cigarette, and a, a sudden splitting migraine. I press my palms into my eyes, trying to get my head straight. I can't even focus on myself now, though. There's people down there, and they need my help. Without even bothering to get rid of the evidence, I'll be back. I drop to the ladder, and I begin climbing down. It's a quiet ride on my bike up to the path that leads to the lake, and a crunchy one for the last mile or so. The only other sound than me plodding through the snow are the occasional gusts of wind screaming through the trees. No, not the wind. Can you hear us? 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 Danger. Drowning hazard. Area is off limits. Now, little signs like that are posted everywhere. It's just keep you out. I disregard them and trek on. I can't 
can't abandon my friends now. It's funny, even though the sun is coming up, it seems to be getting colder. It's always cold. Cold. That's what the rain is. Barbed wire? Oh, fuck, that's right. How the hell am I supposed to get over this? Over there. Oh, wait a minute. That bush. Almost. Looks like there's a hole behind it. Coming right under the fence. On my hands and knees, I crawl through it. I can see it now. It's... Dear God. Will you remember? Do you remember me? Do you remember us? How could you forget our everything? Don't you remember us? It's everyone I know. Every one of you. All my friends. My family. Still, others I don't recall in full. You, you shouldn't be here. Why? How can this be? I have to get you out of here. I won't let this go on. The freezing water is up around my ankles now. With each step, I can feel the ground getting further and further away. Up to my thighs. I'm already shivering. My heart begins to drop. Something's wrong. Help us. Please. Please. Oh, not you. What about all the rest of you? It's all for nothing. You promised. Always to stop for you. Do you remember us? You promised. I'm moving slowly out towards them. I can help. It doesn't have to be this way. We can all make it out of here. Up to my chest. I can't shake the creeping dread from being in deep water. <laughs> when I was a kid, I cannonballed the bottom of my uncle's pole and I freaked. I couldn't move. I flailed about in panic, trying desperately to gain ground, but nothing. I, I thought I was going to die. Someone got down in time to fish me out, but I've got a phobia of water. I never actually learned how to swim. It's all right. There's always time. Don't turn back. Don't leave us. You promise. Up to my neck. It's too late now. I can't find the bottom. I can't. Gain. It's all right. We've waited for so long. 